hey guys and welcome back or to my channel today i have one of an og like type of videos here on youtube which is a what's in my bag video but this one is specifically going to be a what's in my work bag i do work a nine to five job for myself i actually work basically like a 7 30 to sometimes 6 p.m 7 p.m job so you know i do carry a lot of stuff in my bag just to like hold me over for the day but yeah i'm excited to do one of these videos i did it a while ago when i first started on youtube you guys can check out that video up here completely looking different when i was living at my mom's house but i really enjoyed making it the bag was way smaller than what this bag will be but if you guys enjoyed these kind of what to my bag videos definitely give this one a thumbs up also if you aren't already subscribed definitely subscribe down below as i will appreciate it a lot so let's jump right in so i currently have a new bag which was actually gifted to me by my lovely best friend and i got this this past weekend because she actually visited me and this is what she gifted me so it is the base i think it's called the east to west bag so it is called the east to west tote and it has a padded laptop sleeve a trolley pass through which is basically where you can hook it onto your suitcase because this is also like a travel bag so it's not only just for work but you can use it when you're traveling which is awesome because i will be traveling as you guys know in the next couple months so i'll definitely be using this and also has a front zip pocket with a key leash so this is a base bag and it is very very large as you guys can see it has like the slip right here you can like unzip it but i'll obviously show you guys like an up close in some clips but it's very big but i am okay with that because i currently use a big bag for work sometimes i bring my lunch i like to carry my whole life with me i have like notebooks in here that you guys are going to see for my youtube because sometimes when i'm at work and i'm like on my break i still like to plan out my youtube because you know i'm there all day basically when i get home i'm too tired so i like to keep stuff like that with me handy so we're gonna jump into this bag boy and it just has these short straps on the top and then it also has these longer straps which i'll probably be using because i like to just carry it on my shoulder and it also comes with a padded longer shoulder strap so you can use it like at the airport or when you're traveling so that is really nice so we're going to jump into the front zipper right here and a key feature that i like is <laughs> literally no pun intended is this little key holder which is very very great for myself because every time i'm coming home like i'm always digging around in my bag for my keys because i don't have any pockets in the bag that i currently use so this is awesome to keep this on here so i'm just going to unlatch that real quick these are just my keys i had this little lanyard that i got from five below my airpods which i think are like the second generation and then just a bunch of keys on there and then also in that front pocket, I will be keeping my Metro card because, you know, I am a New York City girl. I rely on the subway to get to work. So I feel like this front pocket is very convenient to just grab my Metro card out, grab my keys out when I need it and get ready to go. So now we are going to dive deeper into this bag. I'm going to start off randomly. I will obviously show you at the end all the compartments, but first there is a zipper compartment inside or i'll probably show it on the screen here of each compartment that i'm digging into on the inside towards the front which is on this side there is a zipper compartment so in there i just like to keep these kn95 mask yes i still do wear masks certain times when i'm here in the city i wear it on the train and if i'm in an uber sometimes and also sometimes at work if someone is sick i will put these on just to be sure and we still do wear them at work in our office because you know people still coming in they're sick i work in a medical office so that's just what our policy is at my job which i do not mind next i have my pill organizer which i got from amazon just has a bunch of all my medications some advil tylenol all that type of stuff love this a lot and last but not least in that pocket i love carrying a portable charger with me this one is a great one that you can just plug into the wall i don't know if i shared this in a video but i got this from amazon for my dad for christmas this is a charm mast 
uh, portable charger and it lasts really long and it charges my phone really fast. So this is a 10,000 mAh. H, I guess, you know, like when you see the numbers of how much charge it has, that's what this is. It comes with a iPhone wire as well as a droid one. So sometimes I could charge my cameras with this when I'm on the go, which is awesome. Diving into the main section, you will see that there is a water bottle slot, which is great. I have a water bottle at work and I have one at home, so I don't really carry one with me, but I probably should. But I feel like my commute is so short to my job that I don't really feel like I need one, even though, you know, emergency can happen, delays can happen, so it might be okay to carry one. If anything, I'll just carry like a little Fiji water with me, but for now, I just use that for my umbrella. This umbrella is super old, it's an automatic one, I don't know where it's from, but it is my sister's and I stole it, so I know she's annoyed about that because every time I have it, she's like, oh, I think that's my umbrella. Which it is but i had it for years now and it's still been holding up knock on wood and i don't know how soon i'll be getting another one but i would like to get one of those like clear bubble ones i thought that would be really nice to have and lastly in that main compartment i had this bag full of random things and we are going to go through it this is actually a little bag from some storage cubes that i shared in my amazon travel must haves so we're going to go in this through this randomly I have some allergy medication because sometimes I get like itchy legs when I walk a lot. I don't know if that happens to anyone else. It happens to me and one of my sisters. So I take those if I know I'm going to be walking a far distance just to prevent that from happening. Then I have the Frenchie Smooth and Comfort Cashmere Vanilla Hair, Body and Linen Mist. This is great. I shared this in a favorites video and I just love this to spray at the end of the day, you know, when you're all gross and stuff. And it's sweaty outside but you just want to smell a little fresh when you're getting on that train because the trains are not the best smelling so why not add some nice scent to it then i have the laneige sleeping care lip sleeping mask it just looks like this i know you guys seen this a million times it's one of my favorite lip cares i used to like the um I don't know if the seal bagel like rosebud one so this one's very similar to it and it's not too sticky which i love I also just had this Target moisturizing hand sanitizer because I still love to hand sanitize, especially when I'm about to eat somewhere. Then I had the Sunbum 30 SPF moisturizing sunscreen lotion. I thought this was really handy to have just to put on like my arms and stuff if I know I'm going to be out in the sun, especially during the summertime. I have a $20 bill in here. I also have a pack of Orbit gum. I like any type of sweet mint gum. I feel like I'm addicted to gum because I get really annoyed when I run out and I feel like I always need to chew it every morning or when I'm going home, which I don't know if that's bad or not. I have some safety items in there, which I will not show on camera, but you know, living in New York, you need to be safe. So I'm just gonna put that to the side. But just saying, you know, sometimes crazy things happen out there. So you gotta stay protected, especially for me as a young woman roaming the streets of New York, you know, I'm a New York native, so I know how to be aware of my surroundings, but you never know, you need some safetyness. So I got some stuff for that. <laughs> then I have a bunch of these pens that I took from work. I have a million and one cough drops. I also have these little like floss things, which are really handy. I have this, um, I believe this is the Alien Goddess perfume that I just put into a travel size container, which is really handy. And I had the Ellis Brooklyn Salt Dab perfume, which just looks like that. And then last but not least, I have this Bath and Body Works 24 hour moisture whipped hand moisturizing cream which smells so good so delicious smells like a delicious dessert so that is all that is in that little pouch now we are going to move to the other side which is the side that's against my body in this little slot i have this pen right here i always have a million and one pens then in the little slot on the side i have my wallet so this is just a coach i believe it's like the zip card wallet i just have my id on one side my debit card on this side i have some cash in this which i should put that 20 in there and then inside i just have my cards i believe i got this from my sister for christmas and it has been so handy i love it just the perfect size 
I'm not a big wallet kind of girl, so that was the perfect item for me. Next, I have a pair of sunglasses. These are new. I got them this past weekend. They are from Forever 21, and they are the perfect, like, oversized, chunky shape. And I feel like they fit my face perfectly, which I love. Definitely blocks the sun from my face, so happy about that. And now moving on to this insert part, which is like a little Velcro slot, which is the last two items that I have. The first one is this little spiral notebook, which is more of like my rough draft notebook of just like a bunch of random videos I want to post for the upcoming year before I actually put them into my actual video like log that I have. I have some savings like graphs that I've put in there. I also like write down some to-do list and also like an organizer of how I want to film a video. So like I'll write which video I'm filming and then what order I need to talk about with stuff. So really love this. I got it from TJ Maxx, I believe, and I love their notebooks. It's has they have a wide variety, so definitely check them out. And this spiral one I also got from TJ Maxx. It's this beautiful butterfly print and I just have like these two folders in there and a ton. This is actually my Disney World plans that I've been rough drafting. And then also like one page, I have my 2023 video ideas. These are all the videos that I posted that you guys would have seen. And on the other side, I'm starting the next portion. So I just like to carry these notebooks around. Like I said, because I do work long hours, I wanna just make sure that once the weekend comes, I'm all set for my YouTube and things that I need to plan out and stuff like that. So I like to just work on these when I'm like on my lunch break or when I have any sort of break. Just like to look back and refer to anything for my YouTube or upcoming plans that I have. So guys, that is everything in this bag that I have to share with you. It is such a nice bag, has a little things on the bottom so it doesn't mess up the bottom of the bag. But I love this bag so much. Thank you to my best friend for getting it for me. I'm so happy that I have another like nice work bag to use because you know, my Zara one has been crusty and dusty, even though I still love it a lot, but this is going to be a game changer. So I highly recommend it. If you guys are in the looks for a big bag like that, that you can use for work, also that you can travel with. So I know I'll be traveling with that. You guys will be seeing it in some upcoming travel videos. So stay tuned for that. But once again, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.